if you don't follow me on social media, I guess this is a good time to say I'm blown out. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing this gorgeous purple smoky eye and, and I'm also wearing lashes larger than I normally would. <laughs> but yeah, I hope that you will like this look. I personally love it. So if you like this look, please keep on watching and don't forget to give it a thumbs up and to subscribe to my channel. So I am going to start off by filling in my brows and as usual, I am using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Beauty Express for brows and eyes in brunette. I'm just gonna grab a little brush and fill in my brows. Next up, I'll be taking my concealer, the HD Studio Photogenic Concealer from NYX, and I'll be putting this on my eyelids as a base. And I'm blending this out using my Beauty Blender. And I'm setting this using the color Gleam from the Twilight palette from Models Own. Next, I'm taking the color Bahama Mama from The Bomb. And I'm just going to put this in my crease. I haven't really figured out what to do yet, <laughs> so I'm thinking a halo eye, but I'm not sure. Why not? Let's just try it out. Um, so next I'll be going in with the color Sexy, also from the Bomb, which is like a... It looks like a dark red purplish color, but we'll see. I'll be going in with Bahama Mama again just to soften up the edges.
And next up, I'll be taking this foiled eyeshadow from Effect. I don't know what color it is. is it? Yeah, I'll be taking this color and I'll be putting it on the center of my lid. I think I'll be using my finger, even though I'm a brush person, just because I don't think it will be that great if I use a brush. But let's try it. And let's take a brush now just to smooth this out. There we go. Um, I'm gonna go in with the color Gleam again and put this below my brow to lighten it up a bit. Right now, it looks. Yeah. <laughs> Next, I'll be taking a little bit of this glow milk from the Beauty Crop. In the color Love You So Matcha. And I'll be putting this on the high point of my face. And using my beauty blender. Just for a little bit of glow. I'll be doing my face next and I'll be using <laughs> the cover up foundation and concealer from Isadora. And now I'm going in with that same concealer again and I'm gonna put these below my eyes and so on. Today I want to try out this banana setting powder from Bella Pierre. Um, I'm very skeptical because I'm so pale, but I don't know, we'll see, I'll try it out. I might turn yellow, but that's okay. That is definitely yellow. <laughs> okay, well... I'll just go ahead and set the remainder of my face with this powder using a brush. Um, but I think we can all establish that this powder is not <laughs> for me or anybody of my paleness because it's like orangey. And I kind of knew that it would be because if you look in this jar, it is very yellow. But I'll just dust this on the remainder of my face. And 
you know, we'll just do the best of the situation, so. So, let's continue. I will be going in with the clear water resistant eyebrow gel from the Brow Gal. Just to go through my eyebrows, they're probably powdery and foundation-y now. That's the real word, foundation-y. I'm just gonna go in with the color sexy again and put it underneath my eyes. there <laughs> she was so annoyed i'm gonna grab this color by effect again and put this underneath my eye as well um i'm using a brush however now so i'll be taking the eye studio lasting drama gel eyeliner for 24 hours in black from Maybelline and I'm just gonna make a wing with this for lashes I think I'll be applying these lashes which are called million dollar baby and they're by rebecca Stella. Uh, so yeah i'll just be applying these and then i'll be back here we go i've got my lashes on and frankly i think they look kind of beautiful <laughs> and obviously i also put some mascara on and i've used the volume million lashes in c line from l'oreal and next up, I'll be continuing doing my face. I think I'll go in with Bahama Mama. Just to see. Oh, shit. To see what it looks like. I feel like I look dirty. Just like a bunch of mud around my face. I don't know what I think about that. But I'll use the same color for my nose. This is kind of a first impression. <laughs> I think maybe I'll just mix the blushes called Cabana Boy and Argyle. <laughs> I'll just mix these and use them as a blush. I don't want it to get too dark, but not too light either. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> Next, I'll be going in with some highlighter and I will be using the Mary Luminizer, also from The Balm. There is so much The Balm in this video. I actually really like this highlighter and I have tried it before. Um, I guess I just... I don't know, I kind of forgot about it, I guess. But I really like it, it's gorgeous. So I am taking my nude lip liner from Zadora.
my favorite nude lipstick from Medusa's makeup. It's the one called Sugar Daddy. So this is pretty much it. I'm just gonna fix my hair and give you, well, I'll show you the completed look. So just hang on. It's the finished look and as always, I freaking love it. <laughs> um, if there's something I don't love about it, it's probably the banana powder just because it made my face yellow and you know, it's probably a really good color for somebody darker than me, but since I'm a really pale person, it just looks yellow. Um, but other than that, this look is beautiful. Uh, <laughs> I hope that you like this look too, and if you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. So thank you, bye!